Mmm, that's the taste. And garlic. Mmm, that's it. Saludon, this is Yami Shenny. Welcome to my Yami channel. Today I'm gonna share with you the very detailed recipe about steamed buns, including the ratio of water and flour, how to make the dough, and how to make the filling, etc. I believe that after watching this video, you will know every step and you will get all the details so let's get started firstly let's make the dough put the 500 grams of flour in a big container and then melt 6 grams of yeast and 15 grams of sugar in the little bit warm water and then add the water in the flour in several times and stir well each time The ratio of water and flour is 1 to 2. Stir the flour like this. And now let's start with our hands. When you knead the dough, don't forget to clean the edges. Experienced people usually told you that the three points about a successful dough is 手光盆光面光 that is hand clean, uh, container clear, and dough smooth. But how can we do to do that? Don't worry, I have my tips. Dip your hand in the water and then use the wet hand to knead the dough. Look at this, you will solve all the problems. Okay, now we have a clear container and a smooth stall and a clean hand. <laughs> Ta-da! And now let's leave the dough alone and uh, let it have a rest for two hours. Don't forget to cover it to prevent the dough from drying out. See you later. <laughs> and now it's time to make the filling. Put the slice of ginger and green onion and pepper in warm water and leave them for 15 minutes. Cut the boiled beans into little cubes. In order to enrich the texture of the filling, uh, I will put some leeks inside. Minced meat. Pour the water into the minced meat several times and stir thoroughly each time. The water can make the filling more juicy. Ooh. Okay, let's put some other ingredients in it. Minced ginger, salt, oyster oil, and soy sauce and stir well. Then I will put two spoons of soybean paste. That's my secret. Mmm, that's the taste. And then we will put the vegetables in it, add some beans in the meat, and then put more salt and oyster sauce in and stir well. Ta-da! After two hours, we get the feather dough, right? And now, press the middle part. If the dough does not rebound, it's perfect. Next, knead the dough thoroughly. This will exhaust the air from the dough and make the dough smoother. It's very good exercise. <laughs> Ta -da! What a white and beautiful and smooth dough. And now it's time to make the steamed buns. Roll it into a long strip and then cut into cubes. And then roll out the dough into pieces. Thin at the edges, thick in the middle. 
<laughs> it's so huge, right? <laughs> When we are about to start making the buns, add the leeks and stir evenly. If you put the leeks a little bit early, the smell of the leek will be not good. Put them in a steamer and then let them relax 15 or 20 minutes and then steam. I steamed two pots of buns. After the water boils, steam for 15 minutes. Ta -da! I have finished the steamed buns! Wow, so cute, right? I can't wait! Ta -da! It's the time to eat. It's the happiest time. Soft. Okay. Let's see what's inside. Mm. And garlic. Mm. That's it. Mm. Have you learned how to make the dough? Have you learned how to make the steamed buns? Well, <laughs> I hope the answer is yes. If you like this video or if you like me, share, like, and subscribe. I'm Yummy Shenny and I have more interesting recipes to share with you. Keep following me and let's enjoy every yummy time. <laughs> Mmm. See you in the next episode. Bye bye.